Artificial intelligence is you know, always trying to get computers to do uh, the things that people do and that we can't get computers to do yet. The most prevalent use of robots is in factories. The research is now towards getting robots to be robust in the dynamic open world. In libraries, we've always implemented new technologies. The first question we want to ask is, should robots play a role in the library? And if they do, how do we do that in a way that's truly beneficial? Living and working with robots is organized around the goal of trying to create general purpose service robots. Robots that can be in our homes or that can be in our office buildings or that can be outside on campus. They have to be able to sense their environment, decide what to do and take action. What roles might they take on? And how does that have implications for the work that we already do in libraries and for the people who do that work? Could they envision a robot as coworker? And what would that look like? There's all kinds of opportunities for robots to shift the types of, of labor that, that people do towards the things that people find more satisfying. A robot would not replace the librarian or the library staff who's knowledgeable. In a library, just delivering a book from here to there. A robot could query a system, sifting through a lot of metadata that otherwise might take me a long time. How do you do that in a way that people will embrace? How do we study? the work that's being done in certain areas of the library where we think it might be a good fit, where are opportunities for a robot to be assistive in that process? How can we develop the technology and at the same time roll it out to people and socialize them in a way that people, you know, that's enhancing people's lives? Libraries are a place for experimentation and are a place for learning and trying new things in a thoughtful way. I think in many cases it's going to be that robots will take over part of a person's job and free them up to be more productive on the parts that they like. These kinds of new technologies, these kinds of systems are being deployed. How can we do it well? How can we do it better?